Hi guys and welcome back to the Premium Press video tutorial. Now today I'm going to show you some of the common problems users have when activating or installing their Premium Press theme. So let's dive into it very quickly. So the first page you can see in front of me is the theme activation. So this is where you'll enter your license key. Now if you do not have a license key, you can click on this what is this option and it'll take you straight to the Premium Press website where you can get your license key. And to, act, to locate your license key, you log into your members area and the license key is at the top. So we would simply copy this license key here, go back to the admin area and paste it in this box. Now assuming you've done that, let's go ahead and try it and click OK. The issue you might sometimes get is this invalid license key. Now this doesn't mean that the license key is incorrect because obviously we've just copied it straight from the um, Premium Press website. The most common problem is an installation issue with your WordPress settings and I'll show you how to fix this. So we go to settings, click on general and under the general settings tabs there's two options here. This WordPress address and site address and you'll notice in this case for my example I'm running it over HTTPS but my website is not set up for HTTPS so I need to configure and change that to HTTP. And alternatively, if you're running uh, HTTP and you're trying to run HTTPS, then you go ahead and re-add the S. Click on Save Changes. It should ask you to re-log in again because it's needing to reconfirm who you are. So if I log back in, I go back to my installation. I then again get my license key, so I can get it from the Premium Press website. Paste it into the box. Click OK. As you can see now, the installation is successful. Okay, so let's look at the same problem, but on a WordPress network setup. So this is if you've enabled WordPress network and you're installing multiple websites. So you can see we have multiple websites. And I'm trying to activate this premium press theme, but when I enter my license key and I try to agree, it keeps giving me this could not validate key issue. Now the problem is exactly the same, but the way to configure it is slightly different. So the problem again is that I'm trying to run over HTTPS. As you can see, I have this um, secure sign symbol. But if I view my network configuration, so I go to admin settings sites, I navigate to my site I'm trying to install on. And as you can see under my site address, I have HTTP. There's no S. So what the website is trying to do is force the HTTPS, which is an invalid setup. So basically all I do is I add an S, I save my changes, and now I go back to my installation. So we can go ahead and re-enter our license key. And this time when I click on it, as you can see now, the installation is successful.